Hello everybody, you're looking at a Galaxy DX929 CB radio. I've done a little bit of work too. Uh, maybe it's a little hard to see in this light. I've got nitro LED rings behind the uh, stock knobs. Gives it a back glow that's kind of neat. Uh, a dimmer. Origi the, the nitro dimmer's right here to actually shut them off completely. And um, there's also, there's still the factory dimmer for the uh, rest of the lights, the back light, the meter light, the channel light, you can see that's still on there. Uh, the RF gain now is an echo board. Oops. Check one, two, there's the stock audio. Test one, two, turn the echo volume up a little bit. Audio, check one, two, it's got a pretty good sound to it. I really like these LT2N echo boards. Um, the, uh, as some of you already know, this radio is the size of a Cobra 29, unlike most of the galaxies that are the DX sizes. Some of them big rigs out there only house uh, the size of a Cobra 29. Not a whole lot of radios uh, that Galaxy makes that that uh, are the Cobra 29 size, but. Um, this is a great one. Um, the sister to it, her big sister, is the DX979. That baby has sidebands, so those of you that want to talk sideband as well as AM, you'll want to upgrade to the 979. So, uh, uh, backlit faceplate, SWR meter. You see the SWRs are pretty much flat, 1.1 or so. Modulation meter. Audio, test, power, audio, audio, hello. So, uh, of course, mic gain and noise blanker, talk back high and low. High gets pretty loud after tuning, so it's on low right now, and I'm pretty close to the speaker. I'm using an SRA-198 microphone, great noise-canceling microphone. If I had the stock microphone this close, all you'd hear is a big squeal. So uh, that's what I'm using right now. Um, anyway, CB Radio is pronto. Hope uh, you give me a call and I'll be able to answer any questions. So anytime. Thank you very much. Have a great day.